Hello all. So in today's class, we will uh, look at obtaining the solution of homogeneous linear system using matrix method. So uh, we initially solve for uh, this equation. So we had the equation in the form dx1 by dt equal to a11 x1 plus a12 x2 and dx2 by dt equal to a21 x1 plus a22 x2 and here a11 a12 a21 and a22 they are uh, constants so they are real constants now uh, let us uh, use the uh, eigenvalues and eigenvectors to solve this type of equation so here uh, I'll take the matrix A to be uh, the matrix A11, uh, A12, A21, A22 and I will take the vector uh, X to be the vector X1, X2. So, I will have DX by DT as the vector. So, x and the component wise vector. I will define by derivative vector function. Corresponding components in the derivative. So, that will be dx1 by dt and dx2 by dt. Okay. So, uh, the uh, Above system can be rewritten in terms of dx by dt a and x. So if you take ax, uh, ax in the product, combo, so you will get a11, a12, a21, a22, uh, x1, x2, which is going to be a11, x1 plus a12, x2 and <coughs> You will have a21 x1 plus a22 x2. So your right side is going to be the uh, product ax and the left side is uh, the vector dx by dt. So uh, the uh, equation can be put in the form. So, we will get in the form dx by dt equal to ax. So, here a is called the uh, coefficient matrix. And in the number previously uh, proceeding, so if you are given a linear homogeneous equation, so we will assume that uh, the solution is of the form uh, a e raised to lambda t. So, number uh, x equal to x1 equal to a e raised to lambda t and uh, x2 is equal to b e raised to lambda t or two. So uh, let us seek solutions of this form. So uh, we seek uh, non trivial solutions of the form. So let me take x1 equal to. So, let me take the constant to be alpha 1 e raised to lambda t and x2 is alpha 2 e raised to lambda t. So, here alpha is alpha 1, alpha 2 is vector and x is the vector x1, x2. Now, uh, x is the x1, x2. Aana. So, that is uh, alpha 1 e raised to lambda t and alpha 2 e raised to lambda t. So, I can put in the form e raised to lambda t uh, into the vector alpha 1, alpha 2. So, that is e raised to uh, lambda t alpha. So, uh, you can write alpha. Uh, okay. So, x can be written as alpha e raised to lambda t. So, therefore, x is equal to alpha e raised to lambda t, where alpha is a vector, alpha 1, alpha 2. Now, upon substituting uh, alpha uh, in the uh, equation, 
okay so uh, let us take this equation to be 1 so substitute so substitute uh, x in the equation 1 now when you are substituting x in the equation 1 about dx by dt on another so you are given x here dx by dt number at combo uh, component wise differentiate here. so you are going to get alpha 1 lambda e raised to lambda t and alpha 2 lambda e raised to lambda t so that is going to give you uh, lambda e raised to lambda t alpha equal to a uh, this is e raised to lambda t alpha uh, so you can uh, cancel off e raised to lambda t on both sides so that is going to give you a alpha equal to lambda alpha and now uh, this can be put in the form a minus alpha i uh, sorry a minus lambda i um, Okay, I'm creating the a alpha equal to lambda alpha. So uh, that will give us a minus lambda i alpha equal to 0. Okay. Now um, this will have okay and this equation can be put in the form. Uh, so that is a11 minus uh, lambda alpha 1 plus a12 alpha 2 equal to 0 otherwise a21 alpha 1 then a22 minus lambda alpha 2 equal to 0 and again this will have we need a non-trivial solution so uh, for uh, we get a non-trivial solution when Then determinant of a11 minus lambda a12 then a21 a22 minus lambda equal to 0 or in the matrix notation that is determinant of a minus lambda i equal to 0. Now you can see that uh, this is our characteristic equation which is the uh, characteristic equation of a. So we have arrived uh, to the characteristic equation. Me, um, when you solve for this equation, uh, we will obtain uh, the value of lambda. So solving this, we get the characteristic values. So lambda 1 and lambda Two. So upon uh, substituting the uh, characteristic values, इन्हीं नमक कंडर बढ़ी के अंदर नमक अल्फा इन दामन कंडर बढ़ी का. Okay. So uh, once you get alpha, uh, you can get the components alpha one and alpha two. अदा अगर नमक डर required a uh, b values. Okay. Uh, so नमक characteristic values इटे इन्हें corresponding to lambda one uh, you will get the uh, eigen vectors now once you get this eigen vectors so lambda alpha e raised to lambda t will form the uh, solution of your equation okay so uh, so we have uh, brought characteristic equation अब a characteristic uh, Equations all we have characteristic values get them and uh, substituting lambda 1 and lambda 2 uh, into the system and we get the characteristic vectors so we will get the eigen vectors so let me call it as lambda i so that is equal to lambda 1 i and lambda 2 
i so where you have i equal to 1 and 2 so uh, therefore uh, the system of the form So when you take the system of the form dx by dt equal to ax, so we have seen that uh, it has system of the form dx by uh, dt equal to ax has solution of the form. So x will be equal to lambda e raised to lambda t. Apoda lambda no another. So uh, where lambda is eigenvalue of a and alpha is the uh, corresponding eigenvector. So, number dx by dt equal to ax is solved zero. Your solution is of the form x equal to alpha e raised to lambda t. So, we will see the coefficient matrix and the coefficient matrix and the eigenvalue corresponding eigenvectors. So, uh, the solution will be of the form x equal to uh, alpha e raised to lambda t. In like we have seen in the first case, uh, we will roots the uh, roots distinct. Uh, roots can be equal, roots can be complex. So, we will see the three cases in general solution. So, we will see uh, each case. Now, we will divide the two cases. One is uh, repeated roots. Two roots are equal to the case. Then, two uh, roots are distinct to the case. So, if we have complex root, they will always occur in pairs. So, that will come under the category that uh, the roots are distinct. So, we will see as yes, two cases when you have distinct roots and when you have a double root. So, that we will see in the uh, coming classes.